so what's up guys welcome to the second part of the sprocket tutorial and today i'm gonna show you how to design your tank real quick though so because i it wasn't in my program after that i will show you how to make a cannon depression using a turret and how to add design to your cannon and all that stuff so let's go so here, I, as you can see, you choose the side faces, the side faces, it's just an example, and you click on ex expand, just an example, a real quick example, you click on extend and you have like a, a new thing that you can edit and you really quickly, I take the dots to the other side to make like a, a small face as you can see with this small face before uh, going to the face actually we, um, I'm gonna make make them an, at the same line with the other dots the original dots so it can have we can have a new face from the, the original face as you can see and after that you just edit uh, and design however you wish as long as you understand how it works the rest is your creativity your ideas so I'm not gonna go, go deeper inside designing because uh, depends of your creativity so just uh, with this uh, idea that you have how to make a new face exactly where you want it you just choose the faces and extend it and you will have another design So guys, here I finished the designing the tank and I even made a turret and as you can notice there is like a hole in the front I made this to make the gun because it will be a turret so I will design it so it can fill the, the, the hole and uh, you will see anyways and I recommend you to always name the turrets like the main turrets etc so it will be easier for you to recognize uh, the turrets and after that you choose the hole and you choose a new turret and you put it in, in on the turret or inside the, the hole and to make like uh, to reduce the size of the um, of the turret like that uh, like I just did you just uh, choose all the faces and then you click on S and you move your mouse and after that you, ro you rotate rotate the, your turrets on the side and you fix it you move it like this and of course to just check I recommend you to check always the rotation like this you put the max to 20 and the minimum um, 60 so you can see where it's gonna rotate and you fix it as I did otherwise you will have uh, some problems and after you finish actually putting and fixing that you can reduce that but make it visible at first because 
We will add another turret actually. This is actually visible. You change the name. Uh, gun rotator. It's easier to to find. And we're gonna choose the hull again and click on. You can you can do that. It will be easier for you to add the the, the turrets this way. You do the same thing. You reduce the size, as I told you. You put back uh, your uh, rotator, your gun rotator, and I recommend you to always check that, check the the main gun or uh, turret, and fix it as I did right now. Check it always with a a gun, a cannon, like this, and then you we can try it. You put this. And as you can see there is a problem right now, I just... As you can see there is a problem, but I think... I think it's uh, the... I forgot to remove the... To fix, actually the... the fix... You need to fix the turret. But you don't need to move. You fix it, and then now you know it works. You can design uh, your uh, your turret, your small turret. And from the inside, actually, you can go inside and choose the face inside and extend it. Extend the face and make it smaller and extend again and make it taller inside. Uh, you will understand later why I do that. It's more, it's for the gun actually because you know in game. To make your gun like uh, powerful, have more penetration, you need to to make it taller. And I don't want, I don't like my guns to have like tall cannon. So I make like I make uh, a part of the cannon inside my uh, turret. Don't push it too much inside. If you if you don't want, if you have like a high depression of the gun, if, because when you move your cannon, all what you have inside will go outside. It will be visible and it's it's not good. It's and why do I do that? Because y you may tell me, but we can just push it inside without having to edit the like uh, the design of the you know, the cannon. It's just I don't like uh, the orange cross, you know, I don't like it. I don't like the orange cross, it's, it's bothering me every time. So I'm doing everything to don't have it. But you can do however you wish. I'm gonna quickly make the cannon. And then I'm gonna test it. And as you can see, it's shaking, the can is shaking too much. And it's because of the rotator I have made. It's just too fast, so I, I need to fix it. And to fix that, you can go to the gun rotator, the one that you made. You select all faces, and you're gonna add thickness armor. You can also reduce the ratio. After that, your gun must be 
stable and we are done today guys it's the end of the video it's already long enough so the second part is done and uh, let's meet for the third part see you guys